My name's Mike Cobman and this is my carer, Andrea Lees. My name's Andrea Lees and apparently I'm his carer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I met Andrea on a festival in very worst conditions. Um, We've known each other for a lot other longer, longer. A lot, lot longer. We've known each other for... Umpty odd years, I don't yeah, really want decades. to say. <laughs> uh, but the significant one for Mergen's Keep was a couple of Septembers ago where I had to use... Um, I had to sit on the drunk bench because I was inebriated <laughs> at the rally. And we got chatting and caught up with things. I told her what we were doing. I told her the idea for up here. Um, and it kind of grew from there, really. The original concept for Mergen's Keep, for those in the know, will know that we are, pa well, yeah, I mean, I can say we are paid in individuals. Mm. And Mergen's Keep has always been a deeply pagan company. Um, based in the early 80s, uh, we've done festivals. And originally we were in silver, and then we moved into clothing in the early 90s. And now we're in Preston for our sins, um, producing T-shirts and jewellery for the rock and gothic scene, really. What kind of like hobbies do you have? Like, what are you into? Hobbies? <laughs> <laughs> Um, apart from full-time commitment to Mergen's Keep stage, um, I don't really have time. Is that about right? That's so cool. I love it. Um, Mergen's Keep is probably something of a way of life now for us. Um, we wanted to open something, a shop, that people could feel welcome when they come in. They could look around and say, wow, I like this. They could have a conversation with us and they wouldn't feel um, quite as left out as you do in some shops in some of the bigger chain stores. And it's all matter of fact. We like to converse with people, we like to make people laugh, and we like people to look at what we've done, basically. After 20 seconds, we lift it up, we take it out, and we peel it off, like that. And then we pop it back under. That's a new bright red as well, why does it not look bright right there? Because it's just been pressed, it's still warm. Um, this is Hans, and Hans is a glove puppet from Amsterdam, who I fell in love with when I went on a short break to Amsterdam. And I decided to bring him home and use him as a mascot for Mergen's Keep. Um, when I say I actually fell in love with him, I did actually fall in love with him. And as soon as I brought him back, he dumped me for Bunny so and left who's, me. Who's Bunny? Bunny is Hans's new girlfriend. This is Bunny. Hello. Ah. Anna has her t-shirt. Oh, I, see, I love how you van der spaffed it. <laughs> I'm just like calling it van der Spaft as a verb. So I started out as a silversmith, did a bit in the forces, came out of the forces from an injury, went to uni at Lancaster, came out of uni, and then started working for myself really because I'm, I'm not the employable type. <laughs> I'm well aware of that. I wouldn't employ myself. Yeah, he was involved in a kidnap. He tried to kidnap Mr. Squiggly which was a stuffed squirrel. <laughs> he had his uh, balaclava on and uh, rope round his wrists, didn't he, to try and kidnap Mr Squiggly, but it didn't pan out. Um, we've had no help from the council to help us with the shop at all. Um, like I said, if we'd have been selling food, we would have got um, relief on our rates. As it is now, we've had no help whatsoever so from the council. So it's been purely a self-sufficient type thing? Yeah, 
it, it's um, the only help we've had is from ourselves. All the capital has come from ourselves. Um, we've had no help from anybody else to do this. I've had quite a checkered career in the past. Um, I've had several partners. Um, Bergen's Keith probably cost me three full-time relationships, one marriage, several casual relationships, a couple near relationships. Um, it's just the nature of the beast. You know, I'm never home. Most of the people I started out with years ago are no longer in business. In fact, I don't know what happened to half of them. One time there was 18 of us, 18 different businesses all travelling around doing the festival scene. There's one now, you're looking at him. So either everyone else is far more intelligent than me and got out earlier, or um, I don't know. Far more intelligent. Probably, probably. But we still do it and we still work with the same traditions. Thank mm -hmm. you.